I correct, correct people. Olo rerun ke option for the verse. As Kabi Esi Oba Adeyeye strip her of her royal title in the palace. Hi, correct people. Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time. And the time where you take that see this video. Yeah, welcome back to Texas TV. And we are still on the gist about waiting the sub for palace. As the story will be done, carry come right now from inside the palace of Oni of Ife. Is that uh, Olori Ronke? Right now, we heard that uh, she might be seeking for divorce from Kabi AC because what Kabi AC is doing right now in the palace is no longer in favor of her. Yes, we heard that uh, the remaining title where Kabi AC left for the Oloris, that Kabi AC has already stripped them of the title since Queen Naomi entered palace. So as they are now in that palace, Ruanke doesn't hold any title again at all at all. She has been stripped of her royal titles, though the title is not yet uh, open, but we heard that she doesn't hold any title, she doesn't hold any seat again in the palace since Queen Naomi entered palace that Kabi Esi Oba Adeyeye instantly took away those titles that uh, he bestowed on the Oloris. And they are not happy because they have been blaming Queen Naomi as the cause of it. They have been blaming Mommy Tedine Kawa's return as the cause of their problem. Yes, they didn't know that Queen Naomi's return would be so soon. Up to now, they have not achieved their aim in the palace. And we all pray that this Oloris will not achieve whatever it is that they came to the palace to each achieve. Because they were about, you know, buying KBS so early. Some said Ronke's mission into the palace is to dethrone KBS because she is from a royal family herself. The same with Ash and the both of them are sisters or cousins from a royal family. Ronke is a blue blood, Ashley is a blue blood. So they want to definitely buy KBS so that that throne will leave KBS's palace. So maybe it will enter back their, their own uh, house. And uh, we heard that uh, Tzodi Loba is a gold digger. She has come to dig gold in the palace. So all of them, when they dare, they get their mission. They are not there because they love KBAC. They are there to achieve one thing or the other. But they were caught on a way, as we heard, that KBAC planned about Queen Naomi's return secretly, brought Queen Naomi into the palace. That was when they knew that their plans towards Kabiesi has crashed drastically. Because Queen Naomi will stand in the gap and destroy whatever it is that they are planning for Kabiesi. And it is happening right now in the palace as we heard that this Oloris doesn't have much access to Kabiesi again due to Mommy Tedene Kawa's return. And even since Queen Naomi entered the palace, it is going to two weeks now that she is in the palace, though she left and returned. But Kabi Esi doesn't send other Oloris in the palace. That is to tell you truly from the one that Kabi Esi never loved and cared for them. Because if Kabi Esi truly do love and care to, for them, Kabi Esi cannot just leave them to be uh, you know, Kabiesi will not just uh, stop giving them attention like that. But this one, since we now in the palace, Kabiesi doesn't remember that Ronke exists in the palace. All the charm they are using on him stopped drastically. It stopped working because Queen Naomi has returned. And right now, Kabiesi has made move to strip off their titles that they will not hold title. Yes. It will be unfair that Queen Naomi is in the palace and the Oloris will be holding title. They will not hold title. All title automatically returns to Mommy Tedine Kawa back because she is the queen of the souls, the Yeyelua of the souls. She is the number one, whether she is the youngest. Yes, she is the number one, even though she is the youngest. She cannot blame herself that she married early. 
why other Olori is married there. Late, like Olori, Mariam has been dragging Kabiesi, saying that uh, when Naomi, she cannot bow to Mommy Tedene Kaho, that when Naomi is just a, a child of yesterday, that she's senior with Naomi with almost 18 years to 20 years, that if she bow for Mommy Tedene Kaho, she will let herself down. These are the problems that Kabiesi is seeing in the palace. The same with Ronke. Ronke refused to respect Queen Naomi because they see her as a small girl. But whether they like her or not, Kabiesi has stated it clearly that Queen Naomi must be given every respect. She has been in this marriage for, for five, uh, six years now, yes? 2018 to 2024 is exactly six years. Why did Olori just enter two years back? So the gap is too much and they must respect mommy Tedene Kao. And Kabiye sister that it's clear again that if you know that you cannot respect Queen Naomi, better leave her because the palace cannot contain all of them. Yes, the only people where the palace will fit contain are people will go respect Queen Naomi. And for those that cannot respect her, let them pack up the things and uh, leave the palace. The gate is open for them to cross. And since then, they are still there, but right now we hear that uh, Ronke is going for a divorce. This one is not Kabiesi that wanted to divorce Ronke. Ronke is willingly, as we heard, allegedly, because this information now nah, from social media with the Gadaram, as we as soon as know, we do not stay in the palace. We do not know anyone that gives us information. These are information we get from social media that allegedly all of Ronke might be seeking for a divorce as Kabiesi has stripped her of her royal title since Queen Naomi entered palace. So right now as it is, there is nothing where Kabiesi they do for palace again. She doesn't attend to function. She doesn't do anything at all in the palace. She just stay on her own or she go to where she is managing her business because we heard that Ronke she has a business, a very big and mighty business that she opened in that Ileife that she is managing. And the business is doing well. If you guys can recall, there was a time she called Queen Naomi. She sent an invitation. At a point, we heard they came to Akira to meet Queen Naomi for Queen Naomi to come and be the face of that business. To come, for Queen Naomi to come and model clothes for her. But Mommy said, Nika was said no. Anything we're concerned, room, can anything we're concerned, the Olori say, ah, she's out of it. Yes, she says she's out of it. That she will not have any business to do with the Oloris in the palace. She better stay on her own and have peace of mind than engaging with them. So, right now, my correct people, Olori Ronke is not happy as she's seeking for a divorce. So, leave the palaces, KBSC has stripped her off. All her royal titles. I mean, my correct people, this is what we had happening in the palace. Check them out, drop your comment, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, stay tuned, stay connected. For more updates, we'll be dropping from time to time about waiting the stuff for palace, allegedly. 